Please come back. Oh dear, oh dear. How could this happen? I mean, right after I bought the deeds too. Blam! Down it goes. Come on, Barnum, old boy. You'll think of something. If there's one thing you can do, it's cogitate on your feet. <laughs> like Uncle Phineas used to say, if life hands you a collapsed bridge, make bridge emanate. I think I just curl right? up and die. Refill. Well, wrap me in pigskin and call me a sausage. Look who it is! It's me, Barnum. From Bowerstone, remember? You helped me with my picture-taking business. Not that it ever took off. Still gam plussled about that one. But let's not waste time talking about the past. Look at you now, all grown up. A proper adventurer, too. I bet that sister of yours is very proud. Me, I'm in a bit of a custard right now, and it was all going so well. I made the deal of the century just the other day. This wonderfully strange fella sold me the bridge in Rookridge. Cost me every last piece of gold I had, but a thing like that pays for itself, what with all the trade tolls and everything. Only now, the bally thing's fallen to pieces, and no one can get close enough to reconstructify it. Bandits, you see. Bunch of sprockless rotters. Probably saw them on your way here. Keep popping up all over the place, they do. It's closing you couldn't give them a proper scene, too, could you? For old times' sakes. Oh, I'd be positively ambidextrous if you would. You could even have me old Thessarus. I know it by heart now, anyway. So you'll get rid of all the bandits in Rookridge? Wondrous! I knew I could count on you, old friend. Please be careful, though.
You think you're gonna catch me? Why do you think they call me Dash? Stupid! I could have run the cards before I was out of nappies. What chance have you got? The last idiot who tried to chase me went blue in the face and killed over. And I was already miles away. I could shoot your smug mug all day long. What the hell kind of clothes are those? I'll fuck them after I kill you! You like this flip? Still there. You're wasting your time. You drowsy slug. Look which is mine. Let's see her try to hit you again. This man in Albion. continue to shape the world.
take a chance on a game of, um, chance. Ah, the hero returns! A stupendous success! Jolly well done! Of course, turns out those deeds weren't entirely genuine, so the toll thing isn't going to work out quite as planified. Still, at least it's not me who has to rebuild the bridge now. Okay, so I might be broke, but I'll bounce back. Always do. Anyway, here's my trusty Thessaurus, as promised. You never know when you'll be caught in a lexicological quandary. You are now famous enough to use the follow and wait expression. Thanks to you, the way to Bowerstone is now open again. You know it. You're almost famous enough. A few people are whispering of your deeds, but that's not quite enough. All right, dog. With a few more deeds like that, the abbot will have no choice but to accept you as the escort. A woman against a bunch of bandits? You should have... Don't worry, does it? You...
Finally! I've been wandering this place so long, so lost, so... so angry. I need to find peace. I need to find justice. Maybe you can help me. You have no idea what I've suffered. The pain that still keeps me in this world. I was going to get married, you know, to Alex, the best-looking man in town. We spent so long planning the wedding, picking out the flowers, choosing the food, the music, the words we'd speak. And then, the big day came. And he didn't show up. Please, you're the only one who can bring me justice. I want him to feel what I felt that day. The pain. The humiliation. I want his heart to shatter in so many pieces he can't go on living. It won't be easy, though. You'll have to make him fall in love with you, utterly and completely. Then, when he's ready to accept your proposal, when he can't imagine his life without you, give him this. I've spent a long time thinking of the exact right wording. And even longer getting it onto paper. I am incorporeal after all, which makes it all the more impressive that I managed to get this too. In case you need the help, I know I did.
know how to have fun, don't they? Hello there, Sparrow. Watch where you're going, will you? Thank you, and please come again. Help a fellow out, will you? Hmm. <laughs> Satisfy oh, your food craving dear. <laughs> no one on Barristone has better products. Yeah! You've almost done it. I'm sure a little more renown will do the trick. Don't worry, this is wholly vegetarian. Oh, I didn't see you there. Isn't it amazing? All these people, they look so happy, You're don't they? You're almost famous enough. A I'm few sorry, are don't mind me. Deeds, but that's My name's not quite Alex. Enough. I'm, I'm sure you're a really nice person, but I'm not really much of a talker these days. There's a small sail on nearby. Right. And I didn't have a speech prepared or nothing. Oh, the embarrassment. Thanks. Hi there. Don't Haven't seen you around before. Ale. Get drunk on odds with a... A game of keystone. <laughs> hey, yeah. So, what is it then? Sure thing. Let's get going. Hmm. That's just the pick up I needed. Bower stones, best products. Nicely done. Ah. Oh. All the best jewelry. Yeah. Losing time for all stalls. Incredible. Everyone should see that. Hiya. With a few more deeds like that, the abbot will have no choice but to accept you as the escort. One thing about you adventurers, you live longer than most. I mean, you don't see many old folk about, do you? I once fought a dragon, you know. You've almost done it. I'm sure a little more renown will do the trick. Go on! What better place for it? Thanks. I quite like it here. Just realized I'm running late. See you later. What have you got up your sleeve? Just the thing for this marvelous spot. Go on, it's the best place for it. Superb stuff. Oh, I crave you. 
Don't make me wait. Amazing! Not, not bad. Go on! What better place for it? Oh, so good! <laughs> Just the thing for this marvelous spot. Good stuff! We go shopping today. Make sure you keep an eye out for sand boosters. They're boycotting local businesses. Oh, show me. Show me. Do you know where the nearest office oh, is? Lovely. There's a great place here in town for that. Wow. Oh, thanks. You. Yeah. Um, you. Lovely. I'm just the luckiest man in the world. I never thought I'd find happiness again. I never thought I'd deserve it. There's something I've never told you. I almost got married once before. She was a sweet girl, but we were both so young, too young. I got scared and ran away the day of the wedding. I hurt her so badly. She... she took her own life. I've carried that guilt with me all these years, never dreaming I could love again, until I met you. What? I don't... I don't understand. This was... It was all a trick? No, it can't be true. It can't be true! No! You know, we could get married if we had a ring. Look at that! I was just See, doing that tight scene. I'm so sorry for what I did to you. I've never forgiven myself, you know? And I never... 
I never forgot you. I loved you so much. And I loved you too. Maybe this is our second chance. Maybe we can... Oh. You? What are you doing here? You broke my heart. You toyed with my life and threw it away. And now you're here? This was all your idea, wasn't it? You just wanted revenge. I don't believe this. I was upset. It's not easy being dead, you know. I mean, you'll see for yourself. I never want to see you again. Either of you. Oh. Wait, Alex, wait! You're almost famous enough. A few people are whispering of your deeds, but that's not quite enough. I went there once, but it was a long time ago. Yeah! Smashing oh, stuff! That's nice! Yes! Yes! Whoa! With a few more deeds like that, the abbot will have no choice but to accept you as the escort. Uh, uh, yeah! Oh, great! That's an unusual fighting favorites. style! You've almost done it. I'm sure a little more renown will do the trick. Amazing. Yes! Yay! The shops are now opening! Yeah! Ah, now what you... You're almost famous enough. A few people are whispering of your deeds, but that's not quite enough. I still need to find someone with a reputation. With a few more deeds like that, the abbot will have no choice but to accept you as the escort. Sure. You've done it. Almost everyone in Oakfield has heard of you. Now you can go back to the abbot. What is it now? Yes, go on. Being low on gold isn't much fun, is it? It's you. I prayed for your return. I heard what you did in Rookridge. I think you could be of great use to us. Come, walk with me a while.
Now, nourishing the golden acorn is done with holy water from the wellspring of light. But the spring is located in a nearby cave, which is said to be quite dangerous. Our sacred text says two monks must enter this cave, the strongest and a second of the abbot's choosing. Obviously this concerns me, especially since the strongest monk here is my own child. So instead of a second monk, I have chosen to send a protector for the first. And that's you, if you're interested. The cave is just at the end of this road. You probably passed it on your way here. Our strongest monk will be waiting for you when you're ready. Now then, I must gather the others and prepare for the blessing. Our first hero awaits us, even if they do not yet realize it.